You know, we are two weeks out from Election Day and in the races for governor and Senate. The first and only debates between the candidates have come and gone. And now the debate is, do debates still have an impact on how people vote? Aaron Parsegian explores that question and has a look at the latest polls this week in politics. This week in politics was marked by the lone debate between Republican Governor Ron DeSantis and Democratic challenger Charlie Crist. Were there any surprises? Not really, but there were some interesting moments. Yes or no, Ron? Will you serve a full four-year term if you're re-elected governor of Florida? It's not a tough time. question. It's a fair question. He won't tell you. That Charlie's interested in talking about 2024 and Joe Biden, but I just want to make things very, very clear. The only worn-out old donkey I'm looking to put out to pasture is Charlie Chris. Right now, the latest polling shows DeSantis' lead is increasing to double digits, with his handling of Hurricane Ian getting higher approval ratings. This poll from Florida Atlantic University gives DeSantis an 11-point edge over Christ. Even more recent polls from the state's Chamber of Commerce and University of North Florida has DeSantis leading by double digits as well. Will the debate impact any of this? Well, before they took the stage, more than 1.1 million Floridians already sent in ballots, and early voting was well underway. That's why we asked you, the viewers on social media, do debates have any impact on your vote? Now, this isn't scientific, it's social media, but more than 80% said no on my Twitter poll. We also asked on Facebook. A large majority of comments there said no as well. Debbie McKinnon says, nope, already voted and mailed in my ballot. I don't like debates because it's bad enough watching mud-slinging commercials. I don't want to watch them live, too. I think a lot of people feel Debbie on that one. On the other side of things, though, Roberta Molero says, Sometimes a debate will give me a better idea of the candidates' personalities, how they respond to others, mo more so than their speeches and ads can. Mostly, a debate will seal my decision. But what do the experts think? They don't matter because Republicans are no longer engaging in them. Um, and the audiences for them are small. I mean, they're competing against Wheel of Fortune and Jeopardy, and they're losing. By and large, they're not the game changers that they were 20 years ago. Now, regardless of the debate's potential impact, voters appear to be energized heading into Election Day. We'll tell you what the early numbers are suggesting about turnout coming up in the next half hour. In the newsroom, Aaron Parsegian, 10 Tampa Bay.